And I did hear the Democrats were supposed to have their national convention in Wisconsin. But they couldn't make it. Vice President Mike Pence wasted no time in pointing out that he was visiting Wisconsin on the very day that the Democrats would nominate their VP candidate, not from a convention hall in Milwaukee, but through a virtual feed from Delaware. Where the other side's online, we're going to be on the streets in the Badger State. Pence reminded supporters at a Walworth County manufacturing plant that President Trump and his son Eric also held events in Wisconsin this week. I think it's great that the president and vice president are listening in person to Wisconsin voters. The Democrats moved their convention online due to health and safety concerns from coronavirus. This crowd of about 200 showed little social distancing, and though they were given face masks as they entered, many chose not to wear them. What mattered most, many said, was the vice president connecting with voters in person. It matters that they come right to our state, right to our county, and right to this manufacturing facility. He takes the time to come here and to be with us because he really cares about us. And that's the difference. And those supporters left with a promise from Pence. Get used to seeing us because President Donald Trump and I are going to be back to Wisconsin again and again to earn four more years in the White House. Many in this crowd of avid Trump supporters believe it was the campaign's in-person push four years ago that made the difference, helping them narrowly win Wisconsin. And they believe that the campaign will be able to repeat that again this year. In Darien, I'm Kent Wainscott, WISN 12 News.